Hour, we are fortunate to have his Chief of Staff to speak on his behalf. Please welcome Helen Ann Thrower. Thank you. On behalf of Lieutenant Governor Andre Bauer, I'm very pleased to be here today. I have some prepared remarks, but all I can think about is how much I want to get on that ride right now. <laughs> Holy cow, that's right. That, that's one incredible ride. Uh, the intim yeah, Andre was scheduled to be here today, but due to a slight adjustment in his schedule, he was unable to attend the last minute, which was a very tough call for him to make because he is a big NASCAR fan. The Intimidator expansion is no doubt a huge success for the park as a whole, but it's also a home run for York County and for South Carolina. With 15.2% unemployment in York County, the announcement of such a large investment in this area's economy is a vital link to job growth and increased tourism dollars spent in our state. The people of York and surrounding counties will look forward to the jobs that this sort of project will create. This is true economic stimulus at its finest creating jobs and bringing money into our state the old-fashioned way. At the end of the day, it's pure capitalism and not a printing press that will restore our weakened economy. And I wanted to take a quick minute to share a letter from Andre. Dear Mr. Helms, thank you very much for inviting me to join you today for the announcement of the single largest capital investment in the history of Carowinds. As a huge fan of NASCAR myself, I am especially excited to hear about the opening of the Intimidator in the spring of 2010. As the tallest, longest, and fastest roller coaster in the Southeast, I hope to return next year to experience the thrill firsthand. There's no doubt in my mind that the Intimidator will be one tough ride. South Carolinians have long enjoyed a great relationship with the Carowinds family, and we look forward to many more years of working closely together in the future. You run a fantastic first-class operation, and I couldn't be happier to hear of this important expansion announcement. It is an honor to serve South Carolina as Lieutenant Governor. If I can ever be assistance to you, please do not hesitate to contact me. To date, you've heard Carowinds has spent about $14 million on the South Carolina section of the park. Your county officials have extended a tax agreement with the owners of Carowinds Theme Park paving the way for the park to add an additional $11 million ride on the South Carolina soil. In the spring of 2010, the Intimidator will debut as Carowinds' 13th coaster. It's a total of $23 million project and is the single largest capital investment ever made in the history of the park. We are so proud to have the tallest, longest, and fastest coaster in the entire Southeast. Projects of this nature take many months of planning and negotiating. And we want to take this time to extend an enormous thank you to everyone who helped to shape this expansion and make this possible. Thank you. At this time, I'd like to introduce to you the Vice President and General Manager of Carowinds, Bart Kinzel. Got some tough acts to follow back there. Um, I'd just like to thank everybody once again for coming out, our members of the media, our uh, local government, state government, and everyone in the community who's helped put this project together. We're just so excited about it. And uh, just speaking about Jerry here, I've been with Cedar Fair all my life, and uh, I'm one of the newer ones to the Carowinds family. And um, the staff here is just tremendous, and that's, it's, you know, it's led by Jerry. He's been here since uh, opening season. And I'm just proud to be part of this park and this company. And uh, the staff here is just really excited. When we told Jerry about the new attraction, it was just funny seeing the look on his face. So, <laughs> like a kid in a candy store. So, um, but what what will be good for Carolines will also be good for the Carolinas in uh, tourism. And, and uh, we're real proud of that. Um, this is only the beginning of what will be a bright future at Carolines. So, um, and I'd also like to. Uh, just kind of in amusement park terms, this pretty much puts Carowinds on the map with this coaster of this magnitude. So, and I promise you, you won't be disappointed. And uh, just, I'm um, real happy with our uh, partnership with DEI. And uh, it's gonna be a great season and everyone, uh, everyone will love this ride, I promise you, so, thanks.
I'd like to thank everybody for coming out today. This concludes the press conference, but we do have a meal outside. It's a tailgate party. As soon as you exit, we're going to have everybody exit the left area. Um, in that lobby, we're also going to have interview opportunities. We do have a car unveiling um, that Carrie Earnhardt and Jeffrey Earnhardt will be part of uh, immediately after the ceremony. If you have any questions, any needs, it's our job to make sure that your story is the best possible story that you can get. You'll see people walking around, a lot of staff with yellow and or their silver, black, and white pit crew t-shirts. Feel free to stop them, ask them any questions that you may have. We also have the Carolina Sky Tower that will be open for, from 11.30 to 1.30 for photo opportunities. We have a 10-acre construction site um, that we'd love for you to, to get shots of, and we'll be glad to take you guys there. If you have any questions about doing construction site tours today, we'll be glad to accommodate those needs as well. We thank you guys for coming out. You guys have a great day, and we'd like you all to stay for our tailgate party afterwards. Thank you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that does it for the announcement here at uh, Carowinds. What we're going to do is we're going to play some live video, or excuse me, not live video, but we're going to play some uh, pre-taped video um, from...